Good. I'm going to sit down, take this down a notch, loosen it up. Yeah, that's it. That's I'm a guy from Silicon Valley who uh, wrote software, some of it went to NASA, and I live in rural Tasmania. There it is. And um, I kind of, I've done this script about five times, and I feel like a, the joke I'm saying, I feel like a vegan in a meat conference. Because I want to point out the elephant in the room, and, and a hint about that is this guy, Sir Ken Robinson. Just for the sake of, does anybody know who Ken Robinson is? Yeah. I'm talking to the guy who won the, one of the early heats. Nobody knows. Everybody knows Ken Robinson. Died in 2020. All right. So I've got this. Uh, I'm gonna read. Uh, I've got this app, Classanova, and what it is. If, you guys know the Class app? It's a, it's bundled in with Zoom. So what I've got is I've got the features of, of that chat in class, but it's broken out into a not so pretty but a, a functional web chat. Right. So you've got the video conferencing. You've got your Moodle, your learning management system, and you've got this thing in the middle. It's capturing all those transactions, like where the, the, the kids will hear. I'll give you an example. I'm a relief teacher in Tasmania. If I'm lucky, I'll get I get an attendance sheet, and I get a couple of lines about what the class is. And it's a watered down class. The kids don't want to be there anyway. I um, I get a kid that's in there. He snuck in from another class. Everybody knows, but I don't. He starts acting up, I go over to the guy, I say, hey, I'm going to have to kick you out. And he just runs out of the room, right? No one says who he is. I call the office, they say he's absent today. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a low, easy fruit. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a target. So what this app does, I'm going to try to try to change this. Yeah? Work? What are we going to do? Nice. It's got... Three, we're going to talk about three users, a teacher, a student, a student monitor. So they're all kind of sitting in this chat, but it's like a form. And you've got, um, the student monitor is a special one. I've got parents that are saying, we want, as soon as Billy gets out of hand, we want a phone call. St schools won't do that. So what this does instead is the teacher and the student are interacting, right? And, and I'll show you in the next slide. Ooh, slide. I'll come back. Is this thing going to work for me or not? Here we go. Boom. So what you've got is you've got all these behaviors, and I'm basically like a cop. Bing, bing, I'm pinging this guy. And what's great about that is as he's talking and I'm pinging him, I'm still doing my lesson. Because normally i got to go, Billy, stop talking. And he's all, hey, I stopped the lesson. Right, so I'm pinging him, bam, bam, bam. Now his mother, who's over here also, she, she's in Woolies shopping, and she's getting, as a, as a monitor, which is this one down here, she's getting these bings, and she's not digging it. Right? So, so she's going to say, no PlayStation. And all of a sudden, he's good. Right? And that's what it's about, early intervention. That's just one of the things it does. The other, already, geez. All right, so, so, oh man, there's a lot of stuff I didn't get through. I'm rambling. All right, there he is, Ken Robinson. School is broken, that's the elephant in the room. You eat it one bite at a time, so my bite is this relief system. But there's a lot more on the agenda, which I'm gonna to run to in the uh, question. But this is what we've got. We've got a system that was set up for the uh, factories in the Industrial Revolution. This is what we need. Creativity. We've got 800 million robots doing all the factory work. We need to be able to go back to creativity. Nobody wants to do it because this is a closed system. I don't want to get tarred and feathered off the stage, but it's like this is this is like mafia thing going on. So what I want to do is just take it a chip at a time. I don't even need money. I've got an open source slide here. I'm happy to make it open source. I'm already in the list. See, I'm there. So it's open source. I don't need to make money. We just need to. And what we're doing is going from the bottom, and we're making this thing times up. All right. Thank you very much. Now, Steve, what is your vision of how Classanova will change current education? So, like I said, one at a time. We've got a uh, this little teacher thing we're going to do at the moment. But we've got a, a vision we have to do a step at a time. This is a cloud solution, doesn't store any data. Uh, and you can stream it in and capture and automate these transactions. You use them for automated student reporting. You can, you can uh, plug them into the well-being system. So when a student starts to spike with bad behavior, you can say there's a problem. All this stuff, these gaps it's trying to fill. And um, you just keep chipping away. And the reason you go open source on this stuff. Well, the reason you go open source is because you you compel the slow giant educationist uh, institution to change by making all this stuff work. 
and then they go, okay, well, we got to use it. We can't keep up if we don't use it. Something like that. Thank you so much, Steve. Now, a round of applause.